Hello folks, I'm here on what is a very rainy afternoon to talk to you about Carista. Now I've partnered up with Carista and I'm going to be putting together a few little tutorial videos for you about Carista and the kind of things you can do with it. If you don't know about Carista, it's this tiny little device in here. It basically plugs into the OBD2 port in your car, which in most cars is located just underneath the dash, but we'll talk more about that in a sec. And uh, basically you can communicate with this, with your car, using your mobile phone and an app that Carista provides you there. Um, with that, it allows you to do things like add custom features to the car. You can unlock things that perhaps are sort of hidden from the main menu. You can do diagnostic work yourself. So if the car's developed a fault, plug this in, run the diagnostics, chances are it will pop up a fault code. Sometimes you'll even find fault codes that don't result in a light appearing on your dash or anything like that. So you can get to the source of problems really quickly and save yourself quite an expensive diagnostic fee. And it can also help you if you're doing any servicing or maintenance on your car yourself. A lot of cars these days, if you get a new battery, it has to be coded to your car. You might need to change your service indicator in the car. All these things can be done with this. And then finally, you can use the car to look at live data. So if particularly if you've got a performance car, you're looking at performance modifications, you can get live data from the car sent to your phone so someone can monitor all that as you're driving. Very, very useful piece of kit. Now, we're going to go more into this in a sec, but right for now, if you want to check if your car works with Carista, there's a link right at the top of the video description and pinned as the top comment that will take you to that check feature on their website. Search for your make, your model and your year of car and it will tell you the features that are available to you because obviously what you can do with this in terms of unlocking things and, and programming things, it's going to differ greatly from vehicle to vehicle. Carista is a partner of VW Audi Group. Uh, so you can do quite a lot on VW Audi Group cars and also on BMWs. BMWs is the F cars onwards. If you don't know what that means, don't worry, because as I said, this check feature on the website will walk you all through it. Uh, car brands that you can use Carista with, Audi, BMW, Cupra, Infiniti, Lexus, Mini, Nissan, Scion, Seat, Skoda, Toyota and Volkswagen. As I said, you won't be able to use this on every one of their models but it's a good place to start. And you know, at the moment, if you've got, for example, a Peugeot, this is not gonna be any use to you. So step one is jump onto that site and check out your car. Now, step two would be to buy this little device. There is, a, again, a link to Amazon in the video description. Uh, it's 35 pounds in the UK, and it's gonna be roughly the equivalent of that wherever you are in the world. And great news, there's a discount code for you. Use notaguru25, I'm popping it up on the screen, but put it in exactly like that, and you'll get 25% off the price. So this goes from 36 quid to about 26 quid. So you've ordered this, that's on its way. Next job is to download the Carista app. For that, you just go onto the Apple App Store or go onto the Google Play Store or the equivalent and download the app for your phone. Now, once this arrives, you'll get a code so you get one month free use of the Carista app. Past that, it's 9.99 for one month, 19.99 for three months, or 46.99 for 12 months. Again, I'm talking in pounds here. It'll be the equivalent wherever you are in the world. So next stage, let's say this has arrived. You've got the app set up, hunky dory. All you need to do now is plug this into the OBD2 port in your car. Um, you can probably see there if the camera focuses on it the shape of this port. A quick Google will tell you whereabouts the port is on your particular car but on many of them, particularly VW Group cars, they're just underneath the dash, underneath the steering wheel. So I'm gonna locate this one now and we'll get it plugged in. We're in. So the next thing to do is to connect to that little OBD device. So you'd set that up in your Bluetooth. Um, we'd now put the ignition on for the car, which I've done. If you're gonna be using this for a long period of time, it might be a good idea to run the engine so you don't flatten the battery. Um, I won't be spending too long in the car now, so I'm not gonna do that. But we're now connecting to the vehicle. So we're now connected to the car. That's taken about 15 seconds. Um, you can see it displays the VIN number for the car. Quite useful if you're looking at buying a used car. You can actually make sure that VIN number marries up against the car history search that you do and of course the VIN number on the registration document and on the vehicle. Um, you've then got the options of customise, diagnose, service and live data. 
In the next video in this series, we're going to look at diagnose. So this is a really good one to do, a quick scan of your vehicle and with all kind of things we can pick up for that. Even if your car's got no faults, certainly things that might be of interest to you if you're looking at buying a used car. Subscribe to the playlist. If that video's live at the time you're watching this, there's gonna be a link to it appearing on your screen right now. So go and check it out. Give this one a thumbs up and please come back for more. Guys, don't forget to use that link to Amazon that's in the video description and pinned as the top comment to order your Carista device and use that promo code NOTAGURU25 when you're in the checkout on Amazon and you'll get 25% off. This really is a superb piece of equipment that I encourage all of you to get if you've got a compatible car. Once again, that compatibility checker link is down there for you too. Hope you enjoy the rest of the videos in this series where we look more into what this thing can do.